Greetings and salutations everyone, Hapro here. If you're new to my channel, this is actually going to be the first reaction series that I film. Normally my content is video game and soon to be theater and other nerd related series. However, seeing as it is October and I've been wanting to watch The Haunting of Bly Manor, I felt like this would be the perfect series to do for a reaction video. Now I'm actually not a big horror person per se, my dad is, I'm more of a sci-fi thriller type of person. However, I did really enjoy The Haunting of Hill House when it came out, and seeing as this is kind of the sister series to it, I felt it would be the perfect October reaction video. If you like the video, if you want to see more reactions, please let me know down in the comments what movies or TV series you'd like me to react to. And without further, let's get into the video. I like the vibe. Very interesting. I'm really excited to see the prior Hill House actors and see uh, what they do with these new roles. Oh yeah, the uh, um, guy from iZombies in this. I haven't seen him in anything else, so I hope his character is kind of interesting and totally different from what he's like in uh, iZombie. Good old boy from E.T. It's so weird seeing him acting as an adult, but it's great. I think I'm aging myself on that one. Is that... And weep beside the tree. What's her name from the first series? Yeah. A willow wailing. Oh, I can't remember her name. It's gonna drive me nuts. By the tree that weeps with me. Northern California, two thousand seven. Can I have your attention? Please? It was a different time. You'll get to your meal. That means there's a strong probability that you two get to watch each other die. <laughs> and that's the most well, that's morbid the beach in Bali. Devote yourself to a life of the mind Run. is that you still can your was that Greg Sestero from well, from the room I think I just realized that was Greg Sestero there's no mistaking that voice that's Greg Sestero <laughs> He looks so different. Oh. I'm totally taken aback by this. <laughs> well, that killed the mood. I wonder if she's playing the older version of the uh, character that the other actress is. That'd be interesting. Yep, yep. She's she's playing the older version of uh, her daughter from the original show. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. That's great. Love it. Placed by one Lord Henry Wingrave. Lord Henry Wingrave. Oh, there, there's our first little tiny scare there. <laughs> I have fallen quite in love with London. <laughs> it's crazy to think that she got that Hill House role like right out of graduating acting school. Just goes to show if you've got the talent, you can do anything. Responsibility and yours alone. Don't call on me unless it's an emergency. I'm extraordinarily. He's trying to just pawn off his niece and nephew. It's like, I don't want to take care of them. I'll make someone else do it. One of my more unique, a full-time position in a beautiful country manor to do exceptional children. But I saw your ad six months ago when I first arrived in London, and I have seen it every month since. Seems to me an easy position to fill. At least as you described. She's got you there, buddy. What is the catch? Ooh. That really is the question. Yeah. That's great. Love that. Thank you. The idiots had such good music. Oh, superstitious, especially in the country. So now it's a story. It's a pretty good uh, English accent that he's doing because I'm pretty sure he's American. But uh Gotta give him props for that, that accent. Never mind that parents died abroad. Never mind the gun. <laughs> well, me 
take to them. Be above them. Even the worst ones. <laughs> you just do. Yeah. And you try to help. I could never be a teacher. That's. I've come close to similar things, doing similar stuff, but so teaching is. You've got to be the right type of person for being a teacher. Two children. <laughs> Just got a little drinking, drinking high going on right there with heavy breathing. I'm not. I'm not running from anything. And it hurts me when you say that. You know it hurts me when you say that. Interesting. I love you, Mom. Okay. That 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 was I think that's the same thing from the car. Kinda weird. Silhouette with bright eyes situation. Wonder what that's all about. There's our boy from my zombie. <laughs> and she just passed out in the car. Like most places. This is gonna be like the horror version of Mary Poppins. I can just imagine it. She's so. What's the word for like good like vocal grammar or whatever? I can't it's like well something. I saw some trailers and images and stuff, and it seemed like uh, Miss Grose and uh, Owen might have a little thing. That is a beautiful home. It's a great shot, too. Wow. Or is it? Are they using... Okay, no. It almost looked like the same from Hill House, but the, that one had like one stairway leading up, and this is like two separate stairways. <laughs> Come along, snap. <laughs> Great, love it. <laughs> She's gonna say everything is splendid, isn't she? Hi, <laughs> Oh my gosh. Is she like possessed by a demon that says nothing but perfectly splendid? Not expect to laugh this much at a horror show. Oh, oh the little boy spying on her. That, 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 that's that's kind of creepy. Creep, creepy buddy. He's, his eyes are like dead. Is it cursed? I bet it's cursed. Creepy. Well, she learned how to brew a nice cup of tea in England, because I have a feeling it's going to be horrible. Yeah, that was way too much sugar and, wow. and milk for that, and plus you got to let it steep Owen for like five minutes. That's the cutest thing ever. I know I keep saying it, but there's no other word. Well, I think of a few others. She likes being wound up. Oh, wait, you're not gonna eat? Oh, oh, there you are. I'll have it later. Okay. Mm-hmm. Suspicious. Suspicious. Didn't drink her tea. 
It's like she's getting instructions from the dead. Yep. Knew that was gonna recur at some point. So far not that scared. Not that scared. Still waiting for like a Oh, did she see it? Oh she finally saw it. Okay. Cool. Oh, thank you for making me feel so welcome. It's interesting uh blur camera with like the two thin people in focus. I'm not sure how they did that shot, but is is that like a small scale replica of their house? Mm. Yeah, they're not representations of ghosts at all. Foreshadowing. Not a fan of that. Nope. 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 Okay. Got some some ring action. <gasps> she belongs. Is she in charge of the ghosts? Now now this girl's starting to creep me out too. <laughs> and then she just switches off. Nope. You done. You done. Did it now. You done. Did it now. I would be wearing slippers if I were you. That's an old house. You have no idea what kind of disgusting stuff is on the floor, even if they... Okay. <laughs> what is the noise? Time to perfect your tea making. What, what's in the foreground that's blurred? That's a, that's a dude. That is a dude in... An old school medical mask, possibly. Or maybe just a super like Oh Jesus! <laughs> ah They got me. They got me. Is it better? Did you do it better? Thanks for trying. <laughs> yeah, there's there's that guy again. I knew it. Is that a real spider, or did they digitally put that in? All he did was talk about you two. He misses you both. Mm, I feel that's a lie. No, he doesn't. He knows. Sure you do. Okay. Who's that? It's your bro from another universe. And he's gone. Knew it. Who was it? Uh, don't know. They hung up again. Another one. Oh, we've had suspicious. Oh, new person. Is that the groundskeeper? The gardener did not even introduce herself to the new lord. Interesting. It was a good idea to feed these wee gremlins. We're not gremlins. <laughs> We're very good children. <laughs> oh, is that right? Look, I worked here. Are you sure you saw someone up there? Absolutely. I waved. He didn't wave back. The kids know he something. He's a oh, you must have imagined it. Too. Was that maybe the ghost of their dead father, maybe? So you're not going to eat anything? Oh, no, I already ate. Just here for the company. You must buy this. No, I don't. I wonder if that's going to be a recurring thing, her not eating, and if that is an indication of something in the show. Exploring where you shouldn't be going. Okay, she wants to go explore that area that, he, that she saw the uh, guy in. Oh, there's a little outhouse area, like a maybe that's where the groundskeeper lives. Maybe. I think she's good at her job. It's a very pretty area down there. What's this little voodoo doll thing? Burn it. Burn it. Oh, it's like a little mini chapel or 
something. There's that thing again where they kind of like blur the background that Miss Gross is in, but then the the, the background that uh, main actress is in is also in focus. I wonder if that's a post-edit style decision. Don't normally see that. We're tied to some of Henry's money and the poor thing's heart. Still we all have money. Stick it, Lucas. Maybe that's the guy she saw in the window. To seek her in the days when Griffin situated him to that lake. She drowned herself, huh? Flora found her. Oh no. Found Flora. That's horrible. To hear her tell it, I had been and I remain a very happy woman. <laughs> sure. Of course you have. So there's four lit candles, two for the parents. Who are the other two? <laughs> These two children are hiding something. What are you hiding, children? I don't know if she wants that. <laughs> are you gonna lock her in? Yep. Maybe they locked her in to try and keep her from exploring. Oh, hello. Where'd the kids go? Yeah, <laughs> she's not gonna get any sleep tonight after that. Wow, the door is wide open. And they're both just staring at her. That's not creepy at all. And that's the first episode. So I'm really happy with uh, this episode so far. I really think it kind of eased its way into the horrorness of the show. There's definitely a lot of comedy mixed in with everything. So uh, it was very kind of good to, to get into it that way. Uh, really enjoyed it. I think they did a lot of interesting things with uh, the horror elements. Uh, not a whole lot of... Uh, kind of kind of just quick cuts to the horror stuff and then some misdirections there i do th i think for right now what i'm seeing is we have i think three ghosts so far but obviously they teased more in that house that uh the little girl flora has so we have the i want to say he's kind of like a kevin from sin city that 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 really creepy vibe um i'll put a picture up of of kevin um the the elijah wood character from sin city it's very very much like that the kind of look that they gave him and then there's also the plague doctor like guy that they kind of teased while um dina was up at night or danny sorry danny was up at night uh and they kind of teased him and then of course there's the mysterious woman who i think is represented by the doll that flora has and i'm interested to see if she's kind of like the ringleader or what exactly is going on with that aspect of the story or who exactly that woman is so overall uh really happy with the episode hopefully we get a little bit more horror horror elements going forward but yeah really enjoyed it let me know what you thought of the episode in the comments and uh always please make sure to leave a like and subscribe and we will catch you with the next video